Oklahoma Medical Center. Well, it's estimated that 45,000 people in the United States suffer from severe facial pain and a condition known as trigeminal neuralgia, or TN. Texoma Care neurosurgeon Dr. Abdul Baker joins us today to discuss this condition and how those suffering from it may be actually able to get some relief. So thank you, Dr. Baker, for being with us today. Can we start with what TN is? That's easier to say, TN. TN stands for trigeminal neuralgia. Um, trigeminal nerve is the nerve that supplies sensation to the face. By the same token, if that nerve is irritated for any reason, it can cause pain in the same distribution. Yeah, that does not sound good by any means. So what are some of the symptoms besides pain of this condition? Typically, any pathology involving the nerve would manifest either in pain, numbness, or just lack of sensation. There is a small portion of this nerve that's involved in muscle movement, but majority of the role of this nerve is sensation to the face. Okay, and if conservative treatment methods don't work for TN, could a surgical intervention help? Absolutely. Now, there are different types of trigeminal neuralgia. The classic trigeminal neuralgia, which is lancinating pain, either going from the jawline, sort of in this pattern, or at the top pattern. Um, you, if, it's, if it's your classic form, once you've confirmed with an MRI that a blood vessel is adjacent to the nerve that is pulsating over the nerve, there is a surgery that can be done to separate the nerve or separate the blood vessel from irritating the nerve by putting a piece of Teflon. Okay. Now there are other treatment options too, but this is the uh, most successful non-ablative way to treat this condition. There are uh, treatment options where you actually uh, cause damage to the nerve by giving high dose radiation to give temporary relief but the durability of that treatment is not as robust as uh, surgical decompression. Wow, yeah, so there are definitely a lot of options. This isn't quite as scary as it seems when you know there's a way to fix it. Thank you, Dr. Baker, for being with us today. We'll be right back.